Okay. My trusty running gloves, bamboo boxes, and bamboo. So much dust left. In my Christmas mug. Run, shake your head. Oops. No, you need to hug your downstairs. It is heavily getting in your particular. What's up guys and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you 10 things I can't live without. So stay tuned, it's gonna be a good one. Okay, well before we get started, I think we need to make this video a bit more Christmassy. Can we make it a bit more Christmassy? Yeah, okay. Christmas jumper, let's go. Okay, here we go. This is about as close to a Christmas jumper I currently have right now. The reason why I'm buying a Christmas jumper is because I will be releasing this video on, I think, December 2nd. So basically, it's a countdown towards Christmas. So let's try and make it a bit more festivity. I also think I'm gonna get the Christmas tree and I'm gonna drag it in. Fucking hell. Okay, tree in, and also, I've got hot chocolate. Oh, in my Christmas mug. Stunning. Okay, let's get to the video, guys. It's the beginning of this video with the first pick, which I cannot simply live without, is my headphones. On my keys, I have a lanyard, and I have my Santander cycle thing so I can rent out bikes, and I also have my trusty AirPods. AirPods are the best thing ever invented without fail. Like, you simply just, Put them in your ear, and you can do anything. You can run, you can shake your head, and there is no wires coming down whatsoever to get in the way of anything. So when you're doing your workouts, and I see all those people with wires, you need to invest in a pair of AirPods. Now these are the old ones, they're not even the new ones, and they're still insane, but I'm gonna probably upgrade to the newest Apple AirPods, because they're like, probably the best thing ever invented. So that's one thing I physically cannot live without. Once you go to the AirPod, and you realize that you had wires the entire time, you will never want to go back and you'll be thinking, why did I ever have? They're, they're wires, they're pointless, they're useless. So get some AirPods and they're the best thing that have changed my life. Quite, quite simply, changed my life. <laughs> okay, product number two is my trusty camera. So, this is it, oops, almost breaking it. And I can shoot you guys like, like this, like literally. Oh, it's got self time on ready. Or I can use a digital lens. Boom, they're quite cool photos, I'm gonna put them up. So this, for me, has been such a good piece of kit. I invested in it a couple of years ago, and I'm solely team Canon. I'm slowly edging towards the team Sony, but right now, Canon is my baby, and I love using it as well. This is the Canon 5D Mark Mark IV with the 24 70 mm f2.8 lens. It's just an overall really good lens if you want to shoot landscape or portrait stuff. It's quite an advanced camera. I wouldn't probably recommend someone buying it straight off the back end if they don't really know their photography or anything, because um, you need to learn a bit about it. I'm still learning, which is great, and I love learning about it all. And there's still so many things I don't really know about this camera, which I'm still practicing and learning on as well. So yeah, it's a great thing. I can't really live without it right now, because it's all what Will and I do a lot of our work on. I uh, shoot all my fashion content on here, all my lifestyle content, and then also shoot brand work on here as well, and product shots as well, which has been great, and couldn't live without it. So yeah, this is product number two, or numero duo. Numero duo? Numero duo. On to number three. Kevin Hart did this in his one, and I think this product is better, but I see his point when he said this. So, product number three, underwear. Yes, I have some underwear. But the reason why I'm showing you this underwear, and in fact, this pair of socks, yeah, exactly, is the fact they're made from bamboo. And I got told to wear bamboo boxes and bamboo socks about three years ago, I never did, and I never did it. And then eventually, I found I got some, and I got given some bamboo stuff, and I've never looked back since. No matter how many times you wash them, they are still the most amazing fit. And the socks are so comfortable; they don't fall down. They don't even when you wash them, they just stay the same. They don't like go grey or lose their fit and become like cardboard. Exactly the same as these boxes as well. The best boxes I've ever ever worn. They're called Lazy Panda, and no word of a lie. They are next level and are insane. So, 
get yourself, it's not, you need to hug your downstairs. If you hug your downstairs, you're just gonna feel comfy, all like loosey-goosey, and just feel good. And these are like a nice warm hug. It's like a nice warm cup of cocoa for your underwear, for your, for your downstairs. <laughs> okay, the fourth thing I can't live without is my trusty phone charger thing that you transport around with you in your pocket, which makes your pockets look 10 times bigger. But the reason why I need this is because I'm always on the phone to my manager or I'm discussing my meetings and plans and collaborations or I'm speaking to people all the time about work or anything or even just family, I'm catching up with family or I'm listening to podcasts because I always go out and listen to podcasts. So I've got to always have a full battery of my full battery on my phone. Sorry. <laughs> so basically this comes in wonders. It gives me like two full char extra charges and I couldn't live without it. Obviously I would have one of those phone case things where you can like have a phone case and it charges your phone at the same time. But I don't think they make one big enough for the this big one here. So I haven't seemed to find one yet which is good enough. But this is a lifesaver. It just gives me that extra bit of battery, I guess. <laughs> Number five is the drill and it just goes away like this. So just, it is heavenly. But every day, without fail, I will put this on my body all over and give myself a good massage. It loosens up my body before I train or when I wake up, it makes me feel completely rejuvenated and it basically ensures my muscles are just getting out of all that lactic acid that I don't need after training as well. So put this on me literally every single day without fail and it just boosts that recovery and makes me feel so, so good. They're insane, the Theragun's insane. Don't go cheap and buy the cheap rubbishy ones off like Amazon. Go all out and buy a good Theragun and literally give your body a good blitz. Like this. Look after your body and the more like stretching and mobility and using like, things like this, you're just gonna be able to train harder and for longer and yeah, push your body to boundaries you weren't ever able to before. So take care of your body. The older we get, we need to make sure we're looking after it more. When I was a kid, I'd be able to just not warm up, not stretch, and I wouldn't need to. Whereas now, I've got to take extra care of my body as, as we get a bit older. So this is definitely a thing I can't live without right now. So, these two puppies are two of my skincare products I use every single day without fail. The one on the left here, or is it your right, is the it's Micellar Water, and it's from Typology, and this one on the right here is just basically a soothing toner. I use them every morning and night with a skin pack, a, one of those Pads, is it skin, skin pad? pads? Yeah, pads again, skin, skin pad, whatever. And they've just made me feel, well, made me look so much better. I like feel young, I don't feel younger, but it'd be ridiculous if I felt younger by using them. But they basically just make you look so much better and your skin just looks so much younger as well. I want to be looking 30 by the time I'm 40, not 40 by the time I'm 40. So I want to be looking younger basically. And these two have definitely helped. Because you're living in London, it's a very polluted and dirty place. So when I use when I use these, I get back in from a busy day, then I know that I've got to wash my skin properly and cleanse all the dirt off it. And these two are excellent products. Definitely add a cleanser and a toner into your routine because yeah, they'll just make you, they're just, they're just great. So trust me when I say that, get them in your routine. Number seven is my trusty running gloves. I have been running a lot more recently and I really wanted to get into running more this year and it's been one thing I've actually loved doing. But now the colder months have come, I need basically a pair of running gloves that are just really good so I can just not keep my hands really warm whilst running but also I can grip onto my phone and also can use my phone as well. And these have been insane. You just feel like a really good like, I don't know, I think like you feel like a better runner. Like you just feel like you've got all the gear and no idea. That's basically me. But yeah, a good pair of running gloves has been essential in me improving my runs. Because I've basically, yeah, basically got no cold hands anymore, which is great. So basically just, I'm gliding. I'm like Mo Farah, just head down, hands up, no like this, under the arms or anything, I'm just running. Going, going for gold, baby. Number eight, and that's this little roller here. Basically what it is, it's a roller, so you can get all the hair off your clothes and everything. So basically, jeans, especially black ones, pick up, throw it, and ready. Come on, focus. Okay, we're focused. But basically, it picks up so much dirt, so much of like the dirt on your jeans and everything. These are essential. I go through literally like one of these whole rolls a week almost, because obviously when I'm shooting, I want my fat fashion and I want to be looking good. So using one of these, to get rid of everything, it's just amazing. When, before I had this, I'd always put sellotape around my hands, and my dad taught me just to do this all over. But when I got one of these, it's just changed my life. And I won't travel without it, because they're essential, 
and I'll keep one with me all the time in my bedroom. And before I go out, everything just gets rolled. Just roll it, just roll it over there, baby. Product number nine, almost like a little stationery kit, but my own essential grooming kit. It basically has, has products missing, but the main one I have in it is the tweezers. Tweezers are essential in every man's grooming bag. These are mainly for my eyebrows. If I didn't have one of these, I would have slugs. I used to always go and get my eyebrows threaded, which I think is essential for men if they're looking to take care of their grooming and looking a bit better. Because I always have these massive fat old slugs that used to almost attach on, you can see, they used to attach onto my hair. So I had to get them sorted. It's just as essential to get my eyebrows looking. Good. I better not do it without a mirror, otherwise. I can do it in here actually. But you know, you get my point. Anyway, so. I Right. Great product, always have a good pair of tweezers on you. Lads, we all have to be smelling good. This is my final one, and it is a certain fragrance of mine. Now listen, I have tons and tons of fragrances, and I wear different ones almost every day. Like, I love Creed, I'm a couple of the Lacoste ones at the moment, I love the All Saints fragrances at the moment, and some Hugo Bosses. But right now, one I'm in particular love with is my range of Pen Elegance. So this one is called Hell Fatty Leather and it's just so, so nice. It's just got like loads of notes of like bergamot, it's got some leather. It's a perfect all year round one. However, I would wear it more into the autumnal months because it's a little bit warmer. But it's so good. It lasts so long because it's a perfume. You don't need as much. Whereas in a, a toilet, you need to spray a little bit more on for that longer lasting smell. So this is amazing. I'd highly recommend checking out their collection. Hell Fatty Leather is my one though from Pen Halligan's. Go check them out because they've got a couple of other really good ones as well. And it smells bloody good. So you can just spray it everywhere. We need a couple. Bam, bam, bam. Job done. That is my top 10 things I cannot live without at this very moment in time right now. If I was to choose one of those, so I need them all. I hope you've enjoyed this video guys. If you have enjoyed it, please leave a comment down below. Let me know what 10 things you guys can live without as well. If you have enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and please go subscribe to the channel and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace. Right now, I need to actually, I need to actually pull this back. I need to clean up the flat now. But yeah, peace.